live in exciting times. Futuristic technology is breaking out everywhere with some amazing watercraft and incredible and unique boats, jet skis, and electric surfboards. We saved the best for last, and it's so unique you're going to be blown away. Enjoy the ride. You gotta love cool watercraft, and this one just looks like a lot of fun. The Wokart is a one-of-a-kind water vehicle that combines the maneuverability of a go-kart with the speed of a sports boat. It has an asymmetric catamaran layout with a mid-mounted outboard engine, giving it remarkable performance and handling. What's more, the Wokart engine puts out about 70 horsepower and can reach speeds of up to 40 knots. It also has incredible agility and is able to make sharp turns at high speeds. That's not all. The Wokart is handcrafted in Thailand using high quality materials such as carbon fiber. It's a well made and sturdy watercraft that's built for years of use. The Wokart is a fun choice for anyone who likes the rush of driving fast and taking corners at high speeds like a fast go kart on water. The base price is 9,800 US dollars depending on the features. Next up, we have a pedal-powered hydrofoil boat. Who knew? Dubbed the Jet Cycle Max, it's a single-seat, fully human-powered boat with a hydrofoil. Quite the unique watercraft, it blends the elements of a pedal boat with a hydrofoil and a kayak. How's it work? Jet Cycle Max is propeller-driven by the rider's pedaling. The propeller is attached to the hydrofoil, which raises the boat out of the water reducing drag and allowing Jet Cycle to reach speeds up to 7.5 miles per hour. And it's good exercise. Further, the Jet Cycle Max is easy to maneuver due to its light weight and is incredibly stable, even in rough water, making it a good choice for riders of all skill levels. The Cycle Max is currently on the market for a retail price of just under 11,700 US dollars. You know you want one. Speaking of fun, this one looks to be pretty high on the fun scale. The flyboard is different. It's an accessory for a personal watercraft, or PWC. It will propel riders into the air and through the water using water jets. It consists of a board with two boots attached to it and a long hose that connects the board to a jet ski or other PWC that provides the water pressure that propels the rider. A rider stands on the board and controls their movement using their body weight while directing the water jets. The water jets can be controlled using handlebars on the board. What's cooler is that flyboard riders can fly up to 30 feet in the air and dive down to 15 feet underwater. You may have seen these before, however, flyboarding is a relatively new sport, but it has quickly gained popularity due to its excitement factor and ease of learning. The price of a flyboard varies based on the brand, model, and features, but most flyboards cost between $4,000 and $7,500. This is a must try. Lazzarini is at it again. Dubbed Jet Capsule, it's another luxury watercraft designed by the Italian company's design studio. It's an enclosed capsule-shaped vessel that can be utilized in a variety of ways such as transportation, recreation, or even as a floating home. The jet capsule is powered by a single or dual motors and can reach speeds of up to 40 knots. It has a range of about 200 nautical miles and can be customized with several features which include a small kitchen, bathroom, and of course beds, but there's more. She utilizes a combination of carbon fiber and fiberglass making it lightweight but durable, sporting photochromic windows that change their transparency in response to sunlight intensity. So what does all this cost? Well, it varies depending on the model and customization options, etc. However, the standard model starts at $500,000, but the Hyperjet version can run up to a million dollars. Better start saving those aluminum cans. Don't forget to slam the like and subscribe buttons, then check under the mattress and you'll find that million needed to buy the top of the line jet capsule. Electric surfboards are becoming all the rage. Enter the Awake Ravik S22, the world's most powerful and innovative electric surfboard, designed to test riders like never before. It can go from zero to 30 miles per hour in under four seconds, wow, and has a top speed of 40 knots. That's not all. 
The S22 also has an incredible range of about 35 miles on a single charge. S22 is propelled by a custom designed electric motor that generates 13.4 kilowatts of power. The motor is coupled to a high performance propeller which gives exceptional thrust and acceleration. Further, in addition, the Awake Ravik S22 has a revolutionary battery management system that maximizes performance and range. The typical battery combination of the Awake Ravik S22 costs about $14,700. Who needs waves? You knew it had to happen. E-Boat Racing. The Race Bird is a fully electric power racing boat used in the UIM E1 World Championship. It's the fastest electric boat in the world with a top speed of over 60 knots. The Race Bird is powered by a battery pack that can output up to 350 kilowatts of pure power. It also has a hydrofoil system that lifts the boat out of the water at high speeds, minimizing drag while increasing efficiency. Race Bird measures 18 feet in length and just under 8 feet in width, weighing in at about 1764 pounds. Further, the boat is also made of carbon fiber and Kevlar, making it both lightweight and robust. The race bird is fitted for a single driver who sits in a cockpit in the middle of the boat. The cockpit is outfitted with a steering wheel, throttle, and brake pedals. Those are always good to have in a race boat. Wait a minute, the brakes in the water? This one is really cool looking, don't you think? Called the A2V Shuttle, let's take a look at this catamaran style futuristic looking design. The creators claim it's a new generation of transport vessels because the faster it sails, the less fuel it consumes. What? How is that possible? There's no big secrets here. It's quite simple. When the vessel accelerates, it lifts out of the water, reducing drag, and utilizing advanced aerodynamics, it begins needing much less fuel. Initially, the project was created to transport drilling rig crews, but further prospects became very intriguing. Businesses certainly don't want to miss any opportunity to make extra money by cutting costs. At least two models of the A2V have been sold, one 12 and one 25 passenger versions. The latter version starts saving fuel at 28 knots and can travel about 370 miles at 45 knots. On top of its cool looking design, it looks to be very stable in the water, don't you think? Okay, here we go with the most unique one of the bunch. What looks like a James Bond getaway vehicle and can fly underwater? It's called the Jet Shark, and as you can see, it looks like a shark. But that's not what makes it unique. It can dive under the water and surface much like a shark. Its predecessors, called the Sea Breacher, was what got the ball rolling. They looked like dolphins, sharks, and killer whales. The Jet Shark is much larger and easier to drive and maneuver in the water, according to the creators. It's also a four-seater. You can launch and retrieve it just like a regular boat, and it's super fun to drive. It can do up to 50 to 60 knots, depending on the engine. What's more, it also has sensors like radar and lidar to keep tabs on obstacles that may be hidden in the water. Those sound like really handy things to have. You can own your own Jet Shark with all the bells and whistles for a measly $300,000. Grab the piggy bank and shake it, and watch the money magically appear when you watch another one of our videos.